Hello, my name is Andy. I wear bow ties because bow ties are cool. This is our environmental dashboard for Great Lakes Science Center. And what this does is it helps us understand how we're using energy and water here at the Science Center. This right here is a graph showing our natural gas use at the Science Center. And we can see the different peaks and valleys where we're using a lot of natural gas and when we're using little natural gas. And this is Flash the Squirrel. He is our energy consultant. And he tells us when we're using too much or when we're using very little. And we can use that information to inform how we use our resources. So if we're using too much natural gas during a certain time of day, then we can pull that back and we can uh, adjust accordingly. Same thing with water. Um, Wally the walleye here will tell us about water. And based on what Wally tells us, then we can adjust how we're using our water at Great Lakes Science Center. So that's one of the things that the environmental dashboard does. It will give us that information, but it also give us, gives us information in the form of facts. So Wally the walleye will sometimes inform us about different um, information about the Great Lakes. Uh, Flash the squirrel will tell us how we're using our wind turbine and how um, how much renewable energy we're using. So this is a great way to inform us of our environmental impact and how he, we can adjust that to help the environment further. Here's another another um, uh, another graph here, um, and because it's showing the graph. Now my camera has gotten confused and has darkened everything. Let's see if I can adjust that. There we go. Hello again. Anyway, it's a really great piece of equipment that we have at Great Lakes Science Center, and it's really informative and it's interactive. There's actually a kiosk down here. There it is. And using that kiosk, you can actually interact with it. If you wanted to know certain information, um, you can use the, the iPad kiosk to bring up that information. So thank you very much for joining me for this short introduction to the environmental dashboard. My name's Andy, and stay curious.